Hi, uh, my name is Maximilian Robert Lockwood. Um, this is my channel here, uh, MRL Comedy, and this is Bedhead. It is January 1st, 2023, and this is the inaugural episode of Bedhead, in which I, Maximilian Robert Lockwood, am in my bed, and I talk about whatever's on my mind. Um, I had a series back in 2014, a very, very, very short series, uh, chronicling my journey across the country, and it was called Roadhead, and um, it was just the road and my head while, while I was, was cross-country, um, and I figured, I've been thinking about this for a while, I want to bring back a series um, and call it Bedhead, in which I just talk about whatever's on my mind, uh, whatever I damn well feel like. Um, and hopefully it resonates with some people, hopefully it draws some people to, well, to me, to my comedy, to uh, all of the bloody thoughts that I, that I espouse and everything. It gives me some kind of platform because, frankly, um, you know, people have told me I got some decent ideas. And, uh, and, and you know, people also tell me I'm funny. So... Those two things lead me to believe that, hey, th th this is not the worst idea that I've had. Um, but yeah, what I'm going to do with this is basically when I get up and when I, you know, put my face on, I'm kidding, because uh, I, I certainly don't have my face on. The idea behind it is just it's going to be candid uh, thoughts that I have about current events, uh, about, you know, what is what is on my mind. So um, in the spirit of that. Let's start with just kind of what to expect uh, from Bedhead here again. It's when I wake up, and right now I'm uh, waking up on, uh, this is January 1st, 2023. A little bit late, but this is, you know, I was, I was in bed, I was contemplating this. Um, I'm, I'm disillusioned with a lot, a lot of things. It is difficult to kind of maintain any kind of sense of... Um, you know, the, the notion that everything's going to get better. Um, because all signs point to it not. We have dictators around the world, honestly, within and without. Um, and the rise of nationalism, rapid bloody rise due to, frankly, um, <laughs> social media because... Let's be real, uh, these people were, you know, in the minority yelling into, you know, zines or whatever around town, but then once they got a platform from social media where they weren't just yelling into a void anymore, they were yelling into the internet, other people on the interwebs were like, oh, there, there, there's, there's, there's more of me out there, might as well get on this, and, um, and now we have, uh, well, neo-Nazis and, and fascists and all kinds of fun stuff. Um, besides that, we have man-made global warming, the effects of which we're feeling more and more every day, and yet there are still deniers. Um, people are like, well, it's cold right now. There's a polar vortex uh, bomb, you know, hitting the uh, eastern half of the United States. We have an atmospheric river here in California. And so clearly, you know, uh, global warming, not a thing. It's not how it works. It's not how it works. Um, extreme weather is, uh, is, is one of the fallouts of uh, man-made global warming. Uh, and then we have billionaires that are uh, whom we should eat. Eat them all, starting with the 1% of the 1%. Uh, feated. 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 Um, and... Uh, they, billionaires and, and, and the like are just getting away with sometimes literal murder. Um, and they are, they're the ones that all ire should be directed at. We should stop with the polarization and the, you know, opposite sides of the aisle going at it because honestly it's all just fueled by, um, those who want to set up the smoke screen of, of, hey, you guys fight about death. So that I can get away with, you know, said atrocities. 
So, clearly this is going to be a lot of fun for everybody. Um, and I don't think they're going to be this long. Uh, but this was meandering and this is me just kind of, um, again, trying to be as candid as possible. Um, I do want to, you know, right up top, give a shout out actually to my, to one of my longtime comedian friends, uh, Paul Clay, who said that he sincerely enjoyed when I did Roadhead years ago, just because it was nice and candid and fun on the road, doing some, doing some stuff. And indeed, when I'm on the road going forward, um, I will absolutely do new Roadhead videos and everything. But for now, this is, uh, Max and Robert Lockwood in his bed, inaugural episode of Bedhead, and, uh, thank you guys, tell me guys, uh, tell, tell me what you want from any of these diatribes and everything, uh, should be fun for all, clearly, um, and, uh, hey, honestly, it might even have a joke or two for you in here, so, take care, you guys, I sincerely hope that your 2023 is a good one, I, I, Sincerely, I don't care how you identify, uh, socio-political, um, you know, gender identity, um, wealth, kind of, I, you are all human beings at the end of the day, and you deserve to be treated as such. So, in that regard, please take care of yourself, please have solid, solid 2021, I will be back again tomorrow because I'm trying to make this a daily thing. Take care.